Hello chat folks out there, today in this video I'm going to be telling you guys out there about what I got to on my Thursday. Double Bull of Ever Dove tonight, I can't wait for that, love a good Double Bull of Ever Dove. It's national, not national, it's, it's oh, what, did you call, what is it called? The Festival of Sleep Day, not National Sleep Day, there should be, and I think there is a National Sleep Day, but it's International Sleep Day today, and that's my favourite hobbies. I had a really nice lion this morning. I've got a bit of a cold, so I'm feeling a bit warm. And I got up and had a cup of tea and some jam toast. And my dad and mum were up and they were getting stuff sorted around the house. And my younger brother had work. My younger sister is back up in uni and older sister is at her house. And my old brother had dropped his girlfriend back to the train station. As she was heading up back to Cornwall and I woke up early so I could say goodbye to her and wave off as they went off and then I was working on doing a structure to my book and to do scriptures to so my dog on and that's going really well and I've started watching Merlin and I'm on season one episode three I've got to watch that tonight and I absolutely love it and I've caught up with all my shows that I watched online now but the ones I've watched, they're on Christmas break, so next episodes aren't coming out yet. And I watched that side of, like Supernatural, Riverdale, and The Chilling Fox of Sabrina. The only thing is, I can't, on the site that I watch most stuff on that I can't watch over here, I can't find the Christmas special of Sabrina, The Chilling Fox of Sabrina, so it's really frustrating. So I might have to borrow my brother's Netflix to watch that. And I wrapped up warm with my duvet and a cup of hot chocolate and watched Nana McPhee ever after and all the other films that my siblings normally didn't like to watch because I was downstairs on my own getting the TV watching myself as my older brother has gone to bed and he let me have one of his Christmas food donuts. I had this caramel one which was delicious and then my mum and dad have gone off to one some hours and they're going out for lunch and I am off to the charge shops tomorrow I'm going to be going around to my family friend's house so I'm looking forward to that and apparently it's minus four degrees or something like that very cold so we've got the heating on and I'm feeling nice and toasty warm and I went for a walk with my dog house and I walked up one with my hat my gloves and my scarf on and it surprised me it wasn't actually that chilly out and I got some nice nature snaps and then I got back and had a nice warm shower and it helped my chest a lot because my chest has been hurting quite a lot and then I watched some more Supernatural episodes and Doctor episodes and some other sci-fi and funny stuff and watched the newest episode of this series I'm watching called Marvel's The Runaways or Marvel Runaways and I, whatever you call it I was I used to just call it the one ways, but it's Marvel one ways, and or you could just call it the one ways. But I absolutely love that show, and I watched some AG Girl Doll House Tours, American Girl Dolls. I love them. They're like ginormous, and I also watched some doll stop motion and doll drama short films that people have created and little doll series that are awesome. And also played my doll game slash show. And did some filming, I did that, and worked on some new switches stories for my doll drama and some new songs. Played on the keyboard a bit, tied up the office and the dolls and dolls, and tied it around the house. Played on Minecraft and played Snakes and Adders, Ludo, and some other kinds of board games with my siblings. And I watched some stuff off Cod and BBC Player and catch up that I needed to watch. I watched the newest episode of Hobby City off BBC Player. And I watched some old episodes of Couch Tea. I then was working on some new designs and some painting and colouring pages and listened to a bit of Michael Bruno's Christmas. No Christmas is over, but I just love the Michael Bruno Christmas album. And also listened to a bit of Kylie's Christmas album. And I listened to a bit of Kylie's X album, one of my favourite albums. She's probably done that and Golden. And then also watched some Showgirl Tour clips on YouTube and um, I wish I had been able to go to her tour, her show tour, but I was, I was like six or seven then and 
back then I did not like that noises that much so I didn't think I'd have been able to keep so I'm just so glad I got to see it last year now my eyebrows are crazy I once got told that apparently I had Clara Delevingne eyebrows I wish her eyebrows are on point and mine are just a mess like my life <laughs> only kidding my life's not a mess I'm doing well everything and everyone is doing well life is good so far touch wood don't know why you touch your head to say touch wood people just told me to do that so I I'm hopefully getting a job working in a store where my younger brother works so hopefully I work different days to him because that would be awkward if I work in the same shift I could do everything apart from working with money because my money skills are shocking and I've done work placement in a Gucci cafe but the travelling was getting too much so I ended up working in a garden centre right next to where I live and that was much better but unfortunately the garden centre where I did work placement a lot of people have been let go and it's kind of falling apart so it's a good thing I didn't get a job there because I probably don't know stayed there much longer and so I'm a bit good because I made a lot of friends there and it felt really good there and so I'm hopefully going to work in this store uh, I know quite a lot of people anyway who work there so it would be quite good if I do so fingers crossed for that and I watched some episodes of Charmed and it was from the original with Piper, Phoebe and Paige and I watched it from the beginning to the end I loved that show and I loved the reboot as well also watched some episodes of Escape to Country and Figure of Dibley and watched some episodes of Fire Brown and for my lunch I had a ham and cheese toasty made myself love ham and cheese toasties I used to not like them but I went to Costa with my family and my younger sister used to work there got a load from as they were getting rid of them and I had one and it was delicious so I had one of those and a cup of tea and I just love cups of tea and I say this a lot if you put my arm with a needle instead of blood I think tea probably can't because I just love to drink tea or milk I like to drink tea or milk and it's good because I don't really like to drink water so water is in tea so that's a good thing to do or I normally drink a lot of squash so that's good and I'm trying to lose weight and try and stay hydrated and try and be more healthy and yeah every year is like that but I mean it this time I'm gonna try lose weight because I said about my face being a bit chubby yesterday and my mum said oh your belly's a bit chubby too and I was like excuse me so I'm not and she said okay if you want to be in denial I mean what the hell the thing is I love my mum to bits but she's always the one that points out our insecurities or things that we don't think about and then she'll be like oh yeah this this and that and I was like well I wasn't worried about that but I am now and yeah so that's a bit annoying so I'm trying to not get as obsessed about like my hair and having spots and just trying to not worry about my insecurities and I listened to some music, did a bit of karaoke, I mean who doesn't love a good sing song and listened to a bit of Amory, Brianna and I love Anne Perfect. Perfect is being yourself, not caring what people say or think about yourself and just embracing your individuality and being unique. There's only one you in this world and just be yourself, be proud of who you are and just don't worry about what others may think and yeah, just celebrate your life and yeah, I do. I dance to the, I move to my own beat and I just, I'm happy to be me and yeah, there's always going to be things that people don't like about themselves or would change but don't change that because that's what makes you, you. And yeah, I watched The Haunted Mansion and Hocus Pocus and also watched a bit of The Adams Family Halloweeny films. I know, I don't know why I started watching a few Halloweeny films. It's not even Halloween, it's only just been Christmas, but they were on, so I watched a few of those. And also watched Colt's Bride and I watched Pocahontas and some other Disney films and a little bit of a Disney my phone as I watched Pocahontas and after that I watched Milan, then I watched Tangled and then I watched 101 and 2 Dalmatians that so I've got on DVD. I then watched Penelope, I haven't watched that in a long time, and also Love Rosie. 
and then I was reading some of the manga books that I got for the charge shops the other day and read some vegan Halloween magazines that I got that were in my office which actually to read and then copied some of the designs from the vegan magazines in my sketch pad, well try to anyway, didn't go too well but you always got to practice and get better I didn't copy them exactly because I didn't want to copy them, I wanted to use them as like templates and then develop them and like make them my own and some of them turned out pretty good some of them didn't turn out too well and I am now off to go watch today's Neighbours Henry comes back on Monday I'm so excited for that I hope you guys have all enjoyed this video and all have a lovely Friday tomorrow and a lovely rest of your Thursday and I shall see you soon with new vlog coming very soon bye